Palomar College Planetarium is a place where people can go to experience the universe. It's an educational institution. It's a place for us to educate students. It's a place for us to educate the general public that's curious about space and astronomy. We open our doors to the public on Friday nights uh, where the public can come in and see a planetarium show. Our uh, first show on Friday nights is called The Sky Tonight. We take our audience on a virtual journey through the current nighttime sky. We talk about constellations, planets that are visible. And then we also have a show with what we call a full dome movie that was basically a movie produced for a planetarium theater projected over the entire dome. It's an experience that most people have never had before. On our Friday nights, when it's also clear out, we set up telescopes out on the patio next to the planetarium. The audience can, inside of the planetarium, learn about some of the things in the current nighttime sky, and then they get to go out to the patio and see these objects through the telescopes themselves. So when Palomar College was founded, it was actually named for the Palomar Observatory, which is nearby. So there's sort of this built-in ethos of, of astronomy with the whole college. And so having a planetarium be a, a central part of learning and education here, I think is an important thing. Palomar College has had a planetarium since 1965. It was one of the very first planetariums in the community college system, which made us uh, rather unique. The planetarium in its current form opened in 2012. And with some financial support from the college, we've been able to keep the planetarium as a state-of-the-art facility. So our planetarium on campus is one of the largest in California. It's a theater that sits in a 50-foot dome that seats 142 people. What's nice is that it's digital so that we can take people on journeys to places that you can only normally do in your imagination. The planetarium has always been operated by actual astronomers, and that really kind of makes us uh, something that's a very special part of the community because people can come and actually speak to a, an astronomer and ask the questions that might be interesting to them. People of all ages are naturally curious about space. You know, this is a place that they can come to to, to keep that connection going and to learn about the universe.